Yesterday, Blaine and Susan Barksdale were taken to Florence Jail, and this afternoon they were transported here to Tucson Federal Court. Officials say they are relieved the couple are in custody. At Thursday morning's press conference in Phoenix, officials called it a 16-day intensive hunt. After going through hundreds of leads, the couple was captured with a tip from the public. Officers surrounded the home in the remote area where they thought the couple may be. They called out for the residents to exit the house. First, the owner came out, then Susan, and then Blaine. As Blaine stepped out, he was cooperative for quite a while um, until he got about 15 feet from one of my arrest contact teams. And uh, he became verbally abusive, also made some pretty aggressive movement towards individuals. They simultaneously used less than lethal devices, one being a taser and one being a, the beanbag ground. Um, Blaine went down pretty quickly. Uh, while he was still under power of the tasing, the officers moved in fast. They handcuffed him. They helped him on his feet. They brought him over to a vehicle. The Department of Public Safety released video of the capture, and photos following the arrest were released by Navajo County Sheriff's Department. The crime spree began in April when police say the couple robbed and killed Tucson resident Frank Bly. Captain Scott of Tucson Police Department says he is relieved. Oh, I'll sleep even better tonight. Very relieved. It's very comforting to know that these two very violent individuals are in custody. And here in the courtroom, Susan appeared emotional. The judge dismissed two complaints and then allowed for the transfer of the couple to Pima County's custody. Live from downtown, Stephanie Weaver, News 4, Tucson.